amazing to show all of you. Um, they're very, it's very cool and you're going to be so surprised to see it. That's what I'm going to show you. This. So wow, we have customized stickers that have pictures of me and Fatima. Each one of them holds a special like memory for, like, for us. So we're really, really happy um, that that Muslim Sticker Studio sent us these beautiful stickers. Let's show them one by one each stick. And this is how the beautiful stickers look like. Um, we're really happy and and well, the stickers turned out so beautiful. So the first sticker over here is Mariam and Fatima. It just says our names. So Mariam and Fatima in a really cute font. Now these stickers are so cute, like I've never seen something like this before. So this one, this one is when we were wearing matching dresses. It, it was like the Yasin video. Yes, that's correct. So, me and Fatima um, made this video where I recited to her Yasin and she was reacting to it. So, in the beginning of the video, when she was only like six months old at that time, we were wearing matching dresses. So, this is a really cool video. Um, that's the memory for that sticker. Okay, I'm going to choose this one. Tell us, where, what is that? Does it look familiar? That's the light up. The light up that was in my studio from our old house. Still have it, it's in my room now. So it's a white end that I'm sure you've seen before in many of our videos. So that's a very cool one. Okay, the next one is just a picture of me holding a Quran in an orange hijab. Um, I'm not sure exactly what that was, but I do remember I do remember uh, reading the Quran in an orange hijab in, in front of the Kaaba. So the next one is a picture of me in my ice skates. So that's also very memorable to me because one of my favorite sports is ice skating. Me and my father and um, my sisters, we, um, we always go ice skating um, during the winter. So I'm really happy that... That's not your... What is it called? Rubik's Cube. So basically the cool thing is that these stickers kind of represent our personalities in a way because they have things that we like and YouTube. just pictures YouTube. of our YouTube. memories YouTube. too. YouTube. So yeah, there's a Rubik's Cube. Because YouTube, YouTube. And yes, there's YouTube. There's a YouTube play button too. So those, <laughs> so the YouTube play button is because me and Fatima make YouTube videos, so that's why. And then the Rubik's Cube is because I like to solve the Rubik's Cube. Um, yes, there is a picture of us on, in front of the Kaaba. Yes, so we're both standing in front of the Kaaba. That was very cool, right? I like that one. And then there is a picture of me standing um, in Switzerland in front of the mountains. Well, the mountains aren't in the sticker, but you can see that same outfit I was wearing, so that's why I can tell. And then that's the 1 million um, balloons that we got during the party that we threw for 1 million subscribers. Eiffel Tower. And then there's Eiffel Tower from Paris. So that's one page of stickers. Now let's go to the next page. This is me weighing, weighing my, my pineapple and another thing dressed in Paris. 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 <laughs> graduation party um, on the moon. That one's really cool because it holds a really good memory. So okay. Okay. this one is in front of uh, Canada and Niagara Falls. Yes, Niagara Falls. We were wearing winter dresses because it was cold there. Where both of us were wearing matching pink jackets in front of the Niagara Falls. Maybe you've seen the picture before. There's there's an Eiffel Tower and it's really nice. And there's a cover, it's really nice. And there's a Quran look. It's gray and it has gold, yellow and gold. And then a, a cap of red graduation, I don't know. Graduation cap, because I graduated last year from 8th grade. And this is the one that Mayim was holding, the 1 million subscriber balloons. And they, these are markers of the yeah, Sharpies. And colorful Sharpies. And YouTube, YouTube. Yes, YouTube. The colorful Sharpies, I think, um, represent the Arabic calligraphy that I do, so that's cool. And that's my Salama in the sticker right there, because we both worked with my Salama to create this. Salama was my voice, so that's another one. Oh, and this one is me wearing a green dress, and that's it. And yeah, that's pretty much it. 
And before we end this video, I have a surprise. So basically, these stickers were hand designed by one of our sisters from, from New Zealand. Her name is Sister Mahdia. And we actually decided to hold a Zoom meeting with her so we can talk to her and just like ask her about how she got inspired to make such beautiful, cute, um, and lovely stickers. So I'm really excited about that. Let's go talk to my sister Mahdia. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa Maria and Fatima. How are you, Sister Mahdia? I am good, Alhamdulillah. How are you both? Alhamdulillah, I'm fine. I'm fine too. So, Sister Mahdia, we're so happy to have you here today. Um, it is it is very exciting that um, we get to talk to you in person, not in person, but over Zoom. So we're really happy. I am very excited too. So just a small introduction to Sister Mahdia. So Sister Mahdia actually um, sent us these beautiful stickers that she made from um, stickers, Muslima Sticker Studio. And we're really, really happy to receive these beautiful stickers from Sister Mahdia. She lives in New Zealand, so that's really cool. Um, so we're, we're really excited to have Sister Mahdia with us today. Can we open them? Yeah, so Fatima and I are going to show you the beautiful stickers that Sister Mahdia designed actually by herself, which is so cool. So just show it like this. So let's show the camera. Show it. So Sister Mahdia, when we first saw the stickers, we were so impressed. And mashallah, they look so beautiful. I'm actually really impressed by how good these turned out. Thank you. Jazakallah. <laughs> I really, really like them. Like, I, I don't even want to use them because then they're just going to get wasted. So I just want to like keep them on the paper. I know what that feels like. <laughs> yeah, so mashallah, I'm really, really happy. But um, right now, I really want to talk to Sister Mahdi and ask her about how she was inspired to make these very beautiful and unique stickers. You know, we don't really find such beautiful stickers all the time. Um, you know, in like such a cute way, but also very Islamic, and it's really cool. I really, really, I'm very impressed to see them. Well, it is actually very hard to find people who follow Islamic guidelines when creating YouTube videos, the major one being music and hijab, which is why I reached out to your channel. You don't have an Islamic content. You're a Quran Hafidah, and mashallah Fatima is on the road to becoming one, inshallah. And you and Fatima are such an inspiration to other kids living in the West to memorize the Quran at such a young age. This in and of itself makes you both great role models for the future generations, inshallah. So featuring you sisters as stickers will be a motivational asset. I'm so happy to hear that. Thank you so much, Sister Mahdia. So um, I'm, I'm gonna ask you a few more questions. So. Basically, uh, me and Fatima both. Fatima, you want to tell us about how much you like these stickers, right? They're really pretty, right? Yeah. And the art is, is so beautiful. So would you like to tell us about your passion for like art and designing stickers? Like how did that all start? Okay, so I love drawing. I have been drawing for as long as I can remember. When I was small, uh, in school, our librarian would get me to draw pictures for displaying around the library. After graduating from uni, from uni, I sketched and designed a bias for a company for a few years. And my husband, he teaches Quran to kids, Quran and Qaeda in the madrasa. And he really wanted to give the kids something when they had, you know, mastered a lesson or just simply to motivate them. So what better way than to give them a cute sticker or something like that. So he gave me the idea of turning my drawings into stickers. Mashallah, that is actually really cool, you know. Um, I completely understand when the kids like finish doing something and they have like an accomplishment and you just want to like reward them with something but like yeah. it needs to be something really nice which they haven't like yeah. so these stickers are like perfect for that yes it is alhamdulillah so um did you like take any classes for art or are you just like naturally talented and in, in drawing <laughs> naturally talented no. i never actually took formal art classes so i guess i'm a self-taught artist so yeah after i was given the idea to turn my drawings into stickers i had to go online and do a lot of research on how to do that and how to go about doing that i use a drawing tablet and a software called Krita to digitalize my drawings and of course i use good old pencil and paper 
Yeah. It's really cool. And you know, I would actually love to see like the process of how you like design these stickers and how you drew them. That would be really yeah, cool. Yeah, inshallah. I'm going to yep, give those. Another question is, where can um, my followers and the people who are watching our, our fans buy these stickers? I'm sure many people are interested in like looking at these beautiful stickers. They can buy them straight from our website, which is muslimastickerstudio.com. Okay, so muslimastickerstudio.com. If you would like to purchase these beautiful um, stickers, and, you, and there's a lot more designs too other than just these, so you can purchase any um, Muslim stickers you would like. They're really beautiful. All of them have unique designs. So you're really going to be happy with your purchase. Sure. Okay. Um, I like this one. Yeah. And other mm -hmm. is very excited about these stickers. <laughs> yeah, she is. Yeah. <laughs> so um, uh, just a general question. How do you think together we can create a big impact on the Muslim through these stickers and, you know, Islamic and Quranic content? I actually homeschool my kids and saw that when it came to Islamic content, a lot of times they were lacking in color, cuteness, or were just not motivational enough to hold the interest of a child. Or that the human figures were drawn with detailed facial features, which goes against the Islamic drawing guidelines. So I'm hoping that by us working together, we can present and show young Muslims these stickers in the hopes to inspire, motivate, and instill the love of Islam, as well as the will to learn more about Islam and the Quran. That is absolutely correct, Alhamdulillah. This is really great. Um, and uh, my last question I have for you is, um, how is how is it in New Zealand? The weather, the environment? Because I've never been there, but it's one of my dreams to go to Australia and New Zealand. Uh, New Zealand is a very beautiful country, mashallah. Everything is green. Yes, I've heard a lot about you. Like whenever you go on like the, the pages of 10 best places to visit around the world and you'll see like New Zealand on the top list, so. Have you heard of, uh, I live in Hamilton. So um, which place have you like seen? 10 best places, like which place in New Zealand? Um, I don't remember any specific names of the places, but I just heard overall in general, it's a very beautiful country. Like every- It is a beautiful place. Like we have lots of green fields and and lots of sheep and cows. <laughs> Are there also kangaroos there, just like in Australia? No, no, only in Australia. Oh, okay. But are there any other like exotic animals that you would just find like roaming around? Oh, uh, exotic animals is more Australia type, but we do have the kiwi bird here. Oh, okay, that's very cool. So yeah. when, when we go to New Zealand, we would love to meet you, Sister Mahdiya. Yes, inshallah, that would be awesome. And also, you are invited to our home in New Jersey. Inshallah, one day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, Alhamdulillah, it was really nice speaking to you, Sister Mahdiya, um, and and these stickers again. I'm mashallah, I'm really, really impressed and happy with how they turned out. And you know, I'm going to be saving them forever to keep them. <laughs> <laughs> Never going to use them. Yeah. Fatima, tell us about a little bit. You didn't say anything. Let's see something. I like this one, this one, this so one. So tell, tell Sister Mahdiya which one is your favorite. Story. Which one do you like? Let me see. Tell her which one is your favorite. This one. close? So she likes the one with her in the dress. Ah, I know which one you like. I knew you would pick that one. For me, my favorite one is... Do you want to guess which one is my favorite? Is it the one with you sitting on the moon? Yes, you're right, it is. <laughs> it, it holds a lot of memories, so that one is very cool, mashallah. Yes, it would. I, that's why I chose that one, because it's was so, you know, yes. important. Yes, it is very important. So thank you so much, Sister Mahdiya. Um, inshallah, you I would love you. Me. Yeah, alhamdulillah, we are so happy and honored to have you. Inshallah, we'd love to talk to you again soon. Is that all for joining us today? 
Bethalkallah for having me. If you would like to get these stickers, you can go to uh, muslimastickerstudio.com where you can find not only our stickers but also many other different and unique, beautiful stickers.